Hello everyone, welcome to Simple Trading Style and today we are going to talk about daily stock market update and we will figure out is it bullish trend or what's going on with the stock market world. Let's move to trading view and, and do reveal. It's a stock heat map, very green, green day, bullish day. Everything looks good, all positive, all positive, that's nice. Let's close it, let's see, SPX, S&P 1.3% up, Q's 2% up, Dow 1% up, Russell 2000 1.3% up, Apple 3.5% up, Tesla 3% up, Baba 2.5% up. Very positive, US dollar minus half percent. Very positive, very bullish. Nice. Let's let me briefly mention about my setup. I'm using buy and sell script. If you want to learn more about it, just go to the description. There is the link about uh, trading view setup training and other links about all my trainings. Uh, SMA 200 white line, SMA 10 red line, SMA uh, 5 green line, and EMA 20 yellow line. Buy and sell script, like I said, and volume indicator, MACD indicator, green bar, green line it's a bullish, red bar, red line it's a bearish. Same with the histogram, Heikonachi and RSI, RSI it's a yellow line, Heikonachi red it's a bearish, green it's a bullish. That's all, very simple, but it's not easy because of your emotions involved. Trust your indicators, don't trust your emotions. Okay, um, and for for swing trading, I'm using 4 hours and daily time frame for entry or exit position and exit position. Okay, let's start. Let's start SPX. Positive day. Positive day, bullish day. MACD is still green. Heikonachi green, nothing changed, still bullish day. It has bearish divergences, it built bearish divergences. Daily time frame, look at it. Uptrend price action. Volume is still downtrend direction. Uh, RSI downtrend direction, bearish divergence. MACD histogram downtrend direction also. MACD bearish, bearish divergence is on all indicators. Let's move to 4 hours time frame, same story. Even like even bearish divergence is on the MACD line on histogram multiple multiple bearish divergences price action is up by signal bullish signal on all indicators macd red but heikonachi and uh, ma5 with bullish crossover bullish trend and one hour time frame for spx bullish trend on all indicators with bearish divergences like it showed you already Price action is uptrend. Look at it. MACD has bearish divergence. RSI, same story. Bearish divergence. All indicators st still positive, still bullish with bearish divergences. Multiple. Qs. Qs was negative yesterday on all time frames. Today, Green day, 2% two, two up, very positive, very bullish, but still negative signal. MA5 still did bearish crossover, still below 10, volume is still decreasing, MACD red still bearish, uh, Heikonachi still red bearish, RSI still bearish. Looks like bull run, bull trap, we'll see it's a bull trap, but still Trend is still bearish, we'll see. Market never goes up or down straight, li straight line. It's always up and it's always up and down. Buy signal in 4 hours time frame. Uh, all indicators, yeah, MA5 still below 10, still bearish. MACD is still bearish, volume still decreasing. Uh, how can I change color from red to green? Mix mode, two indicators bullish, two indicators bearish on four hours time frame for Qs. One hour time frame, definitely it's a bullish. Bullish on all indicators. 
Let's move to Dow Jones. Dow Jones daily time frame. Nothing changed. Same bullish trend. Bullish trend on all indicators with bearish uh, divergence on the, on the volume. Volume is decreasing, but trend is still bullish. These two lines, red and, and green, it's a, it's a upper and lower trend lines from started from 14 months ago. Similar on, on the SPX, I didn't show you, look at me, let me show you. On, on XPS, similar on daily time frame, still the same, same trend line. Let's go back to Dow Jones. Dow Jones daily bullish, right? right? Bullish, all indicators bullish. Let's move to four hours time frame. Four hour, it's a, it's a resistance zone, right? Now let me go back. Let's go back to daily. See this price action, it's a resistance zone. It was a lot of resistance in this level. And we'll see, will it get rejected from this point or not? One hour time, fr uh, yeah, four hours time frame, still bullish on all indicators, no changes. Still bullish, one hour time frame, let's see. Still positive, still bullish on all indicators on one hour time frame with huge bearish divergences, right? Price action is uptrend. Look at it on the, on the, on the MACD, bearish divergence. On RSI, same story, bearish divergence. Bullish trend with bearish divergence. It wants to go bearish, but still bullish trend. IWM, Russell 2000, daily time frame. Buy signal, MA5 did bullish crossover over 10. MACD green bullish, Iconachi green bullish. Bullish trend on all indicators. But remember, all moving averages still below 200. It is negative, but signal is bullish. Four hours time frame. Four hours time frame, sell signal. Bullish trend. Yeah, for some reason, for some, for some reason script is gave us sell signal. MA5 still the bow MA10, bullish. MACD green bullish. Iconachi green bullish. Bullish trend on all indicators. But remember, all moving averages below 200 still in the bearish territory, still in the negative zone on 4 hours time frame, but signal is bullish. 1 hour time frame, it is bullish. It made 20 did bullish crossover over 200. Even 200 is downtrend. You see down spot on the 200, it is negative. It is bearish. But it made 20 did bullish crossover, it is positive, it is bullish. MACD bullish, Hikonachi bullish, all indicators bullish. Let's move to Apple. Let's see what's going on with Apple. Apple daily. Apple daily, positive day. MA5 still below 10, still bearish. Ugh. MACD still red, still bearish. Hikonachi still red, still bearish. For hours time frame. Four hours time frame, buy signal, MA5 in bullish crossover. Uh, MACD is still bearish, Hikonachi green bullish. Four hours time frame, it's ready for bullish reversal. One hour time frame. One hour time frame, it's a nice run, buy signal, bullish trend. MACD did bullish crossover, green line. Green line. Are assigned the overbought territory. Hikonachi green. Bullish trend on all indicators, but are assigned the overbought territory. Tesla. Tesla 3% up daily time frame. Let's see. Green bar. MA200 white line still downtrend. It's bearish. And remember, all moving averages below 20 below 200 and bars below 20 it is negative it's negative territory macd is still red still bearish hikonachi is still red still bearish for our time frame buy signal ma5 did bullish crossover macd is still red 
okay can I just change color from red to green uh, for our time frame Tesla wants to go bullish one hour time frame it is bullish right one hour time frame it's bullish on all indicators let's move to Baba Alibaba group daily time frame daily time frame sell signal on the script bearish reversal signal on the MACD and Haikonachi red bearish trend on daily time frame let's see four hours four hours sell signal on the script bearish crossover it touched yeah, it closed yesterday below 200 but it came today above it stopped at 200 actually bearish signal on all indicators all indicators bearish and one hour time frame let's see one hour time frame is bullish it's bullish on all indicators it bounced from the resistance line now it's bullish on all indicators dxy usa dollar let's see what's going on with usa dollar daily it is bearish right sell signal on the script macd red bearish it's a bearish but it has bullish divergences you see the price action is downtrend and uh, moving averages macd macd bullish reversals bullish bullish divergence ah sorry about that i just deleted deleted awesome oscillator uh, for usa dollar bearish divergence on usa dollar you see on awesome oscillator from this point to this point it's an uptrend direction uptrend direction bullish divergence on macd bullish divergence price action from this point to this point it's a bearish trend right bearish bearish direction let's let's remove it yeah, multiple bullish divergences dollar wants to go bullish it will be bearish for indexes but so far it's still bearish okay let's do summary let's do summary all indexes still bullish except q's q's still weakest index all indexes spy dow jones iwm bullish with bearish divergences q's on daily time frame still bearish on all on, on daily time frame uh, on yeah on four hours time frame it's still bearish with we'll see some positive indicators and one hour time frame it's bullish it's all bullish but all in the all indexes still bullish with bearish divergences and remember bearish divergences always work work before and will work again it looks like it wants to build another bearish divergence maybe it will retouch and move up and retouch this upper level and after that it will be sell we'll see still bearish divergences nothing changed on the technical side thank you so much let's move to disclaimer i am not a financial advisor this video for educational informational purposes only and remember for educational purposes we are using paper trading account thank you for watching simple trading style video i do publish daily updates for stocks etfs indexes and cryptos Please subscribe for YouTube channel and click like button to support the channel. I really appreciate all your efforts. Thank you so much and good luck by now.